Earthquake. Around the world, the ground moves several times a day. These moves are small earthquakes, which are very weak and no one notices them. But sometimes, earthquakes can become very strong and cause great damage. Epicenter. The epicenter is the point on the surface of the earth closest to the inner point where the earthquake originates. It is usually the place where the most serious damage occurs. Colliding plates. The rocks that form the Earth's surface also move. They can move sideways or up and down. The line separating the tectonic plates is called a fault line. When the plates move, they cause vibrations that propagate on the Earth's surface and make everything tremble. It's an earthquake. Tsunami. When an earthquake occurs at sea, the vibrations cause waves. These waves grow and grow until they are huge and break on the coast. Sometimes these waves can also cause great damage. Seismometer. The seismometer is a machine that records the seismic waves that cause earthquakes. Richter scale. Not all earthquakes cause the same damage. To know the level of severity, a scale is used. It's the Richter scale and has 10 levels. From level 6 onwards, it's a serious earthquake. Do you know what to do and not to do in the event of an earthquake? the seismograph. The larger the oscillations, the greater the earthquake. Mm -hmm. 